Hello friends, in this video I will speak about how can we make the Microsoft Office 365 login page customized with the company brandings. Friends, my name is Praveen Balan. Let's get started. When we actually log into our um, Office 365 tenant with the username and password of our own domain, it takes the Microsoft own branding details. Let's see how a login page look like without any customization. Click sign in. In this case, uh, my domain is answerarena.com. And you can see it is all Microsoft on the top. All default Microsoft banding. Click sign in. This is something that you can notice. Stay signed in. I will speak about it during the video. Now you logged in. Let's now see how can we make it more customized. First of all, you need to go to portal.azure.com. The customization is not available in the normal Microsoft Office 365 admin center. It is available under the Azure Active Directory. Use the same global admin account that you used in the admin center. Log in here. You can see I'm already logged in. Click on Azure Active Directory. And now in the left side, as I go, it is there's a section called Company Branding. Sometimes you will see a default branding available. If not, no need to be worried. Click on Configure. And then this is the place. It is as simple. You can do it in two minutes. But the only thing that you need to make sure you have these customized sized image available with you. The first one is the background. And where the size is 1920 into 1080 pixels. And the size should be less than 300 KB. Likewise, so let's, and I've already created a couple of JPEG or PNG files. You can see that it supports PNG, JPEG, and JPG. And the next one is the banner logo. It is in the size of 280 into 60 pixels. Uh, while I am making this video, what I used is a PowerPoint, and I have saved it as a JPEG file and edited in a Lemus Paint. So you can make use of your graphic designer in your company if you have. As you navigate through, you can see some additional settings. These are optional. If you really want to go in depth, you can read about it. But there are some areas wherein uh, the logos are available only in, only in the square type. And uh, to support it, you can actually upload some square type images as well. And there are two ways. One is where it is dark background and one the other one is like light background so you can choose different colors if it is necessary this section is important show options to remain signed in this is what i mentioned during the last time we did the test login choose yes if you want it to be visible to the end users otherwise you can choose no and save it and that will complete the customization company branding we plan to do it on our tenant now let's uh, try to log in click sign in and the moment we enter the username with the dom customized domain and click sign in it will start populating the customization that we did it will not show the microsoft default login anymore now we can see the background is changed with the thousand one nine two zero and zero eight zero image that we uploaded and the banner logo is also available and type the password and click sign in now it will ask whether you want to stay signed in the last section that we chosen during the previous customization page we can just go back one more time just to show the settings yes Say yes or no of your choice and continue. Now we completed the login page customization 
with the company branding guidelines for your office 365 tenant do it on your tenant ensure that you have your customized login page for your company thanks for watching subscribe for more videos and share your comments i am praveen balan signing off